good to meet you here, Marina Kufa, with Mr. Mel Novak. I want to congratulate you on this amazing award today. Thank you. It was a very special moment. It was. It really was. Living Legend Award. Like I said, up there, usually legends, they already passed away or they're real old. That's why I always say, you're not old till you're cold. 35 years, I was at the Union Rescue Mission as a celebrity. And I started doing services there of all the Skid Row missions. And then it went into prisons all over the country. Uh, I've been in Pelican Bay. It's the worst penitentiary in the country. So, so no matter what you go through in life, or, or no matter if you get a role in a movie, great. If you don't, I don't let it get me because I see people who are broken, rejected, abandoned, betrayed, drug addicts, uh, alcohol, walking wounded. And I counsel. Always to encourage, edify, and uplift. Yes. So that, that's a great balance. You don't see me with my head hanging down because uh, the movie not released or something. I just go about the Lord's business. Live it and live it and health is the most important. You got your health, you got wealth. Yes. You have yes. no health, you have nothing. It's not easy because I've never was able to leave all the heartache like in Skid Row in prison. I can take more if you want. Sometimes I come home and you just sit and cry yes. with people. Well, that's normal. We're human beings, so it's part of it. It's part of life. And also, I get a lot of proposals in the women's prison. <laughs> oh, yeah? Yeah. Oh, check this out. <laughs> now, I also heard that you, you said it um, right on the stage. You have your favorite award was Single Mother Award. Or Mother? The Sing Brownies is right before... Uh, Girl Scouts. Oh. So I was a single dad, and I had my daughter was seven and ten when their mother left us. So I took them to the brownies, and, and they watched me how I, how I was with my daughters, and the other kids liked me. And so they said, This is the first time ever, it'll never be anymore. But we voted you Mother of the Year to Brownies, and that was my favorite award. You know, I've been in three Hall of Fames and Martial Arts Hall of Fames. I got awards in uh, the movie industry. Uh, I got a lot of awards in Skid Row and prisons yes. too. And how are your daughters? They're great. I got a great relationship because I was there. Mm -hmm. I loved them unconditionally. I never lied to her, never broke a promise. And uh, I quit acting for like two and a half years so I could get healed and be there with them. Yes. Yeah. And, not, and then, no. <laughs> and Leah, uh, Gary Marshall wanted her to do a role in his one movie. She didn't want anything to do with the no. industry, which was okay with me, because it's oh, very you difficult. Know. You know, choices. Yeah, choices. But she wanted a model, so I took care of all that. Got the pictures, got her an agent. Different passion, yeah. And what I do, mm -hmm. when she'd have interviews, because some of those photographers are le le leeches, not, I'd wear my, my gangster outfits and I'd be looking at them. <laughs> She'd introduce me. This is my dad. How you doing? So don't mess with my daughter. <laughs> I started, I never, I didn't come out here for modeling. I had played pro ball, baseball, and I got, I was crippled for five years. They butchered my shoulder. I was a gimp. Oh, you had a surgery? Yeah, they butchered me. It was like a rotator cuff or what was yeah, it? Yeah, except I have 18 inch scars. And so I got tired of people telling me I should have gone to college because yeah. I had 60 scholarships mm -hmm. in football. And I came out here and this one, I was working at this insurance company. This girl said, you know, you really wear clothes well. I, my, my cousin is a modeling agent, like a meter, yeah. So I started modeling, I loved it. Oh yeah, I bet. And then I went to some acting classes and... Uh, and you loved it more? Oh no. The, the acting? Yes. I think I liked them both the same, but I, I don't have time to do the modeling anymore. But uh, I wore, I wore, if you saw Syndicus Masher, I wore a lot of my suits in there. That The, the guy that just did the interview, he uh, got my picture on his martial arts cover and about Seneca Smasher. Go on YouTube 
Oh, I, oh we love you too. <laughs> Syndicate Smasher trailer. You, you'll see. I mean, I shot a whole bunch of people in that one. Oh, God, I love it. I, had, I also had a girlfriend. <laughs> Had, had a love scene. Then a Yakuza killed her. The next day I got my, my Uzi out and I found the four of them, trrr, trrr, killed all four. <laughs> no emotion. Oh my God. Yeah, we, we love scenes. Action is always good. Yeah. Yes. What, what, guns, what, what gun is your favorite? What do you like? I shoot? like the Uzi because all I did was pull a trigger. It went trrr, trrr. <laughs> But I have a Beretta. Uh, yesterday I was with uh, a fundraiser and I was with his producer director, uh, Fido Rivera, who signed me for a TV series called Scorpion Girl. Oh, wow. I play this lawyer who's mean. When he negotiates, if you, don't, you don't agree with him, he shoots you. And uh, he signed me to do a movie in Colombia, a big mm -hmm. budget of movie. They have a lot of guns in Colombia too. I know. I was thinking. I don't know if I want to go there because I'm, I'm an actor, celebrity from Hollywood. They might kidnap me. You can handle it. You can handle. Oh it. yeah, I tell rip your eye out. <laughs> With martial arts and all those guns. Well, you know, we had two stabbings last year in the church service in, in LA County Jail. In the church service. So I had a service three days later, and I told them, I said, "Listen, I know you all heard about the stabbing." So I got to express something. Any of you come at me with a shank, it's not going to take your eye out, then I'm going to repent. That's it. Nobody Don't said boo. Because <laughs> what's the last thing you want to lose is your eye. Yeah. Now you got pretty eyes. You want to lose. So I don't want nobody coming at me because I got to sign a paper if I'm taking a hostage. They don't yeah. make deals. Don't mess with that guy, <laughs> I tell you. But we're definitely going to go on YouTube. And we got you media will repost it, which is us. So stay tuned. And so far, you are watching We Got You Media live, oh. and we're gonna say goodbye for now. <laughs> Thank you. Deutsch, willst du irgendwas auf Deutsch sagen zu deinen Freunden und Familie? Auf Deutsch. Ich freue mich hier zu sein. For for everybody, hi and I'm virtually and and a super superstar. <laughs> Merci, Ibrahim. Merci.